the Xinwen Zhuo, the compare the two activity participates in the HCI International 2023 conference. You are very welcome. Six speakers are giving presentations today. Yes, we can hear you. You can go right ahead. Uh, good morning and good uh, afternoon, everyone. I would like to share my presentation with all of my friends. It's about sustainability in technology robotism in economic cycle of rural communities of cultural creative design. So this is the of uh, this discussion. And I would like to start with the idea that sustainability is highly notion in the Hia Village. I would like to present one of the case study in Hia Village in Indonesia. So actually there is uh, people in uh, Chihia. Most of them uh, work as traders in the local community. And the communities, banana trees, there is a lot of banana trees. This is a potential place for sending a tourism resort. So the idea is the local people use the banana leaf as a commodity. They export the banana leaf to the capital city. And this village is the supplier from the capital city. But there is the remains, banana they just put it around the trees, put it around the uh, home fields, and they do not know how to use it. And th this is the trend. The banana trees use it in Indonesia and, and Java. It's increased from the year to year. And the idea, the material uh, from the ritual to form, could be an approach to produce a local community. So the idea is why we don't use this kind of uh, residue, uh, I mean the banana stalk that just put it away to create another uh, product, another creative product. So the idea from this wall, as we know that from the Cambridge on a dictionary, uh, identify that wall is uh, something activity that do every day and every time. And in this context, I would like to say that it can defined by the daily living of Chihia people. So that's the first step uh, idea to the circular economy is by uh, mention by notice what they do in daily life. So about the idea, two form, two form here is the idea that uh, what they do in daily living, uh, what they always do, and what they need for their activity living. That's become the basic idea to define what kind of product that we will uh, create. So the expectation that the product we create is locally useful and globally meaningful. And this is how we do it. I'm so sorry, there's so many <laughs> motorcycles. Uh, this is the idea. So the ritual to form is the adapting method. So like this, the ritual translates as local daily activity. Uh, and the form is the basic, that's the formulating the, the creative product. So when we see the form is translated as creative product, creative product will be uh, local community with which is using the local re resource it's become the local market and become global market because in the local they can use this for their daily activity and the global market they can use this as the product signature so that's that's uh, what i mean by locally useful and globally meaningful and how we can create this is the method how can we create we can uh, use the three three basic ideas: the Maslow diagram, the uh, analysis model, uh, cultural innovation, and Rampino's pyramid of innovation. So, in the first step, we have to define what kind of activities. And we know in Maslow diagram, there is a pyramid that mentions what kind of the activity that uh, people do to fulfill their needs: the psychology, security, social, and etc. And the, the ritual uh, analysis model from Lynn and Crave said that there is a three layer, uh, three level of culture. The outer, the tangible one, the middle behavior, and the inner is the what is inside, uh, what is the meaning and spiritual thing. And the rapino uh, define, uh, we can create a product. We can uh, innovate the product from the uh, four approach, the aesthetic, I distinguish the looks from the other competitor products. The use by upgrading and updating usage. And the meaning associating with symbol and typological by changing the formalistic uh, archetype. So that will become the uh, creative product. 
So this is the example. If we put the physiological uh, level in the Maslow diagram, we can see that in the physical, uh, psychological, there is uh, like a fit clothing in place. Let's say we we identify what they do for feeding, what they do for, for eating. And the other uh, levels, the tangible level, of course, is related with the artifacts, uh, cooking tools, uh, cooking material they need, they use for the cooking. In the rapino, we can use this in the aesthetic level, at least in the aesthetic level, because once the material is innovate, is changed, there is a different looks. So the aesthetic will be another level. Then, then this is the way we can see the local commodity into the creative product, which is we hopefully can be uh, locally still useful, but globally meaningful. So the idea, this circular economy will be uh, will be applied in this kind of idea. Of course, this is the bigger idea. And we expect that this will be narrowed down into the some parts of another research, our next research. This is a pilot project. And I would like to finish this presentation by quoting that sustainability is our chance to redefine ourselves. No other creator creates a damage to the natural world except us. We live in circle of production consumption that grow uncontrollably bigger and faster, forgetting that the natural world is limited resource. So by using the local resource, by realizing what they do for living, so we can create a creative product that still uh, fulfill the daily activity, but also have a value for the global uh, market, in especially in creative industry. Thank you for attention, and if there's any question, it's open for all of you. <laughs> Thank you.